Skin irritation can happen from polypharmacy, which means too frequent and too many changes in products or skincare. Now, every time you change the product, your skin will actually try to adjust to that change that you put in. Hence, too rapid changes and too frequent usage of many different products may stress the skin too much. Polypharmacy may actually unveil an allergic reaction because when you actually try to use many different products and the skin is stressed trying to adapt to the changes, it sometimes may give rise to inflammation on the skin. And if, in fact, it becomes very difficult for you to be able to piece out what is actually the problem. If you start five different things at the same time, invariably, if one of them causes a problem, you wouldn't know where to start. There are well-known harsh chemicals or like bad ingredients that we all tend to try to avoid. For example, excessive use of SLS in cleansers can give rise to stripping the skin of too much moisture barrier, giving rise to dry, sensitive skin. On the other hand, fragrance is also another thing that patients with maybe eczema skin type should avoid because they could be allergic to some of these fragrances. But finally, too much of a good thing may also be a negative outcome for your skin. For example, AHAs and BHAs along with products like retinoids can be great for certain skin types. But if you use them excessively and you stack the products, you may give rise to irritation. Basically, you should not overwash your skin. Less is more. If you think that you have oily skin and washing your skin five times a day is going to help, you are wrong. This will give rise to a very dry surface whereby your skin or your sebocytes will try to compensate and produce more oil to replenish the parched skin surface. It is important hence to use a suitable gel-based moisturizer to make sure that the surface is not over dry at the same time. 